we're staying. We're just going out for a walk now. This is the, uh, we used to call it the Fuerte Calisetti. Um, now it's called the Ole Nurka. But that's our block there, block two. So just a little uh, bit of filming. There's a beautiful beach, the Torox Beach. Thursday the 6th of January 2022, stood on a beach in Spain. Perfect place to do e-liquid reviews. <laughs> Beautiful day, it's about 20 degrees, something like that. We've been a few times at this time of year, but uh, the weather is far superior this time. Just to see, taking in the sights of uh, Torox Costa. I've left the car at home today, I've actually, you know, I've got my feet. I've been, I didn't realise if you put your feet one after the other, you, you move about. I thought you just had to put something in gear. And a romantic walk up the beach with my beautiful wife. Say hello. She's um, saying she didn't want to be involved in any of this. She some, seems pretty good at it. I don't know if you can see over there, there's um, loads of RVs all parked side by side. There's, um, you can actually stay for free in most places in Spain. You'd have to check out what the rules are. But if you're in an RV, you can just pull up and stay for free. But it changes if you've got a caravan. I'm not sure what the rules are though. You'd have to check. Over there, if you zoom in, see right up to Nurka. If you go around that corner there, further up you get to Herodora. And then Alam, Marina del Este, Alam Naka. That's something you don't see in our country. Parrots in their natural habitat, just having a feed. get this show on the road. So we've just been into Torox Costa to a fantastic restaurant that we went with a friend of ours, or two friends of ours, should I say, uh, earlier on, well, late middle last year. And uh, they kept coming and asking us for our selection of food and we thought they're gonna bring that much, we're not gonna be able to eat it, and then we're gonna get a massive bill. So they brought quite a lot of food, we left a little bit of salad, that was all. There was fish, weren't there? Uh, and a, a seafood salad, oh, and a nice morning. big salad, and fried aubergines with salad, and honey on top. And um, when we got the bill, it was 24 euros. I had a beer, Sue had a, um, a glass of wine, because that's what she runs on. <laughs> that's what you run on. Well, you only had one glass of wine, didn't you? Yeah, it's a wages for not being a film crew today, so you shouldn't have got any wages today. So we're just going to walk back now. And um, I should be a lot fitter by the end of today. So I don't know if you can see, this is a lovely place to walk now. Look at the view down there, look. The boat. Oh, there's a boat out there. Let's look at the boat. I you to see it on there, but it's zooming in. Now, that there's, a beach, there's a beach bar there. That one's not open at the moment, obviously. In the season, that'll be flat out all day and night, well, late into the evening. Just right in front of there, it's an excellent place to uh, have a meal, straight in front of the sea. Show you these beautiful buildings. A lot of these are available, mm. apartments in them are available to rent. I think we, I can't remember which one it was. Oh, that blue one there, we were, uh, I don't know if you can see it, that blue one, we, we actually rented a place in there, but. For some reason we couldn't make it, so we had to cancel it. Beautiful. We were looking at the property prices in that um, shop over there, in that um, estate agent, and for a not very large flat around here, 190 grand, well, euros, 190,000 euros. That was nice, look at those uh, good balconies on the outside. What a lot of them seem to do in these areas with the uh, 
balconies, they blast them in. Which is my, one of my worst nightmare, but I suppose if you're living there full time, the balcony's not much use to you in the uh, in the winter, so you might as well have an extra room. Ford Mustang. Here we go, look at this one. Beautiful apartment block up there. We've seen it on multiple occasions. It actually looks like a boat. They've shaped it like a boat. The balconies and at the back of the uh, building, it's flat. So it looks like a boat. That's a beautiful restaurant. Presumably that means the anchor. These are, these are cool. I've got some photographs of them on my Instagram. Two massive chairs and a sun parasol. <laughs> They're really cool. Back on the theme of the campers, look at all these parts up here. It's a site full of them. To be honest, when it gets to that um, density of people, you might as well be in a bloody flat. Last little bit just before we go back over to the um, apartment so I can rest my weary legs. My feet feel like they're actually falling off because I'm uh, unfit. Uh, this is just a bit of rocky enclave just across the road. Before they put this roundabout in, just there. That, that area there used to be open, so you could drive across it and people used to park the campers on there and speak for the night.